I didn't know this. I thought that was the end. Webster's Dictionary defines band as a flat, thin strip or loop of material put around something. <laughs> but this band became so much more. They took something that was so incredibly difficult and made it sound so incredibly simple and flawless. They, like, renewed my hope in rock and roll. Through all the triumph and all the heartache, the band stuck together through thick and thin, becoming the world's most famous rock and roll outfit. I can't think of any musician that I know that hasn't been heavily influenced by their work. We set the bar high, and uh, the rest is history. Always drawn to the spotlight, the singer became the mean judge on a popular singing competition TV show and capitalized on that notoriety to become a powerful spokesperson against the heinous Free Whale Meet for Prisoners program. <laughs> Known to the band as a true diplomat, the bassist permanently emigrated to Gurdzblekistan and was promptly elected president and eternal bringer of the funky bass lines, which oddly was already the official presidential title. <laughs> a true master of the skins, the drummer was inducted into the Drummer Hall of Fame, which was totally a thing in Schenectady, New York and became permanent tabloid fodder thanks to a seemingly endless string of romances with high-profile underpants models. Ah, there you go, Cal. And the guitarist continues to tour worldwide, offering free guitar lessons to inner-city youth and penning the highly successful memoir, Badder Than You Wants Me To Be, A Shredder's Tale Of Life On The Road. They gambled on rock and roll, and they won big, earning nearly unanimous critical acclaim. The first time I saw them, I was just like, they get it. Legends in their own time, Plus several other times after that, the band truly defined what it means to be rock stars. Cool.